getting the day started. The Vans Pendleton Takahayashi series for this year. I bought three of the slip-ons and two of the skate Hirachis. A lot like a skate high, but modified to his design. A very good pack this year, and a lot of people are jumping out and buying the slip-ons in multis like I have. Just because they're all different. The dust bag is very nice as well this year. They've really gone out for this Hayashi pack. He designed a rug. It's multicolored, and I'll try to get a picture of that in the beginning of the video that I've downloaded off the net. I'm not paying $300 for the rug at this moment. And then based upon the cut, be it in the, the cloth, which is multicolored, or the dots, which are multicolored, you can get, get different blues, reds, grays, browns, that type of thing. My first pair is a combination of the blue and the white. And a lot of the pairs that I've seen have the tiered, let's call them diamonds, I guess, going the other direction. This one here is more going upward. So it's a nice, different effect from the ones I've seen so far. I definitely like the all brown on the side on this one. Now, this is only my first one. I have two more, and I might get caught up in the hype and buy another one. You never can tell. The others ought to be landing very soon. Fantastic leather on these. They're a vault pack, and they've really gone out this time. The design is the same as last year's. But this time, he actually designed the actual cloth, the blanket that was cut up and used. And I think they had a little bit better control. I always like the little extras that he puts into his foxing. Midsoles. Outsoles. All the extra little details. Not uncommon to find a Hayashi with either two or three different colors on the outsole. This is a common theme now with that uh, half and half broken on the line. The Pendleton wool, the moccasin style stitching, sticking with his Southwest Native American influence on his Japanese culture and blending it all together successfully, always. And I read recently there was a uh, group that were not as well off in J Japanese culture that were a lot like the Southwest Native Americans, and that's influenced a lot of his designs. These are over the top. Got two more coming, then two of the Skate Hirachis, all the Pendletons. It may just turn out to buy another one today. You never can tell. Got up this morning, got both of the ASAP Fergs. The Addy E's, both colorways, passed on all the other hype of the day, and came out money ahead, $70 each, $140 for the pair. A lot of people don't even know there's a white one and a black one. So, so far it's been a good day and I'm very happy. Hayashi number one, four more to go so far. As always, you can find me here, SamCult12, Instagram, YouTube, Viddy, and the rest, Twitter, SneakerTube TV. And I continue to downsize and sell my shoes at GoodShoes.com. I'll post them from time to time over the years. As well, I have auctions on eBay every weekend, SamCult12. Chance to get a few grails as I downsize my collection and let them go. Try to get to a reasonable size. I appreciate everybody. 
continuing to watch. Tell your friends. Please rate, comment, subscribe. Continue the support. I appreciate everybody who's bought the shoes. I'm not real happy with the one or two that asked me if they're real. Well, of course they're real. You can watch them here and you can see as I've collected over the, over the years. But that's the nature of things these days. Thank you to all. And I will continue to buy shoes and post up the videos for everyone to enjoy. Thank you for the support. I do appreciate it.